Hello. I'm going to contend here that we do not need a big platform and we do not need leaders to create the revolution that we need this century, which is a democratic revolution, a universal revolution, and a revolution primarily in values. Values of tolerance, values of democracy, values of helpfulness, as in enabling people, as in basic income, as in education for all, and non-idolatry, not having any idols, not worshipping celebrities, not worshipping other people, not <laughs> including leaders, and... Uh, basically proceeding the way that I see demonstrations developing right below my window, right here. I live in the middle of Manhattan, uh, looking down on Broadway, and uh, I see demonstrations all the time. And these, these are people who are nonviolent. These are people who uh, are walking along, and uh, the best of the demonstrations when uh, the police uh, manifest their uh, presence, oh, they turn the other way. They go another way. They don't uh, confront. Why confront? Uh, when you are out there, even if you say nothing, um, people are going to notice if, you, if you're sort of walking along with others and... and uh, in a, in a group, yeah, people are going to notice and they're going to say, oh, there they are. And who are they? What do they want? Who, who want? Who is leading them? Nobody's leading them. And we know what they want. They want not what we have, not what is on the corporate drawing board. We don't want oil, we don't want fossil fuels, we don't want that kind of thing. We do not want a consumer economy that is going to uh, uh, explode uh, with uh, a kind of growth uh, of more junk. No, no, <laughs> we're going to create a sustainable world, all those nice buzzwords. Yeah, we're going to do it. But the way to do it is through messaging. We have, we have ah, legions, beyond legions. We have more power than the Rome ever had among people <laughs> to just simply say, no, no, we're not going to uh, tolerate this stuff anymore. No, we're not going to. And we have uh, all kinds of venues to uh, send those messages out. So that's what we're going to do. We don't need leaders. We don't need uh, a big elaborate platform. We want to cut armaments uh, in half, I would think. We want basic income. We want uh, car, if not car free, at least we don't want to be uh, wagged by the car uh, forever. Whatever you want for your four-point Bernie Sanders-ish type platform, make it your platform. Make it something you can say in four sentences. And that's enough. That's all that's all that's needed. People say, well, what do you want? Oh, we don't want a, a violence. We don't want a world of violence. We don't want a world of uh, global warming. We don't want a world of waste and junk. So forth and so on. It's real simple. Message revolution, a revolution of messages, and a revolution out there in the highways and byways, but nonviolent, silent, and non-confrontational, and massive. My wife is uh, in her 70s, I'm, I'm 80, and uh, 
if, if we go out and there are people marching, we join right in. We join. <laughs> Why not? Why? <laughs> we join in. It's a demonstration that, that it's us and and everybody else. And and uh, we we put thumbs up and so forth. It's not a binary thing. Everybody said, well, we'll have a binary election. Yeah, we did have a binary election. And <laughs> look where we ended up. We don't want binary anything. What we want is um, triadic things, uh, things that come because we thought through things. And we thought about the ethics of it. We thought about the aesthetics of it. and And we got somewhere. That's what we want.